the world-famous Paganini Violin center stage tonight at the sold-out Ohio Theater. Considered by many to be the most famous violin in the world, Niccolo Paganini's Il Canone Violin will be in Columbus until Sunday on display at the Museum of Art. But tonight, it was not on display. It was in use. The Paganini Violin, 276 years old, but in the hands of modern-day virtuoso Joanna Frankel, it came to life again. The violin rarely leaves its home in the Columbus sister city, Genoa, Italy, and it is rarely played. In fact, the mayor of Genoa only heard it played twice before. And I'm very happy and proud and honored to be here. Mayor Marco Bucci heard the Paganini played for only the third time in Columbus and considers it to be a piece of art that helps connect the two cities, the two cultures. It's a good sign of being a sister city like Genoa and Columbus. Not only for Christopher Columbus, that was a big leader and a big example of the navigator from Genoa, but also from Paganini, that was a very good musician, very expert, and uh, very famous at that time. Paganini was incredibly gifted with talent so beyond other musicians that it was believed to be otherworldly. To have a deal with the devil, like he was doing things that nobody else was capable to do at that time. And I'm not sure anybody else will be able to do it right now. But nearly three centuries later, the sound of Paganini filled the air again. And you can see that violin at the Museum of Art through Sunday, but it will be some time, maybe years, before it's played again.